this arm. I'm going to teach them. I'm going to leave you. I'm going to leave you. Okay, uh, you said he has trained for one and a half months in Libya. They have shown them how to operate AK-47 rifles in Libya, how they can fire, how they can dismantle and cope with the AK-47. And they have also uh, taught them how to disarm security agents who are holding AK-47 rifles. So these are the trainings that they received in Libya. He said among the 13 of them that were arrested, two of them have gone for training in Libya. <coughs> Why not he said, he said this guy also has received training in Libya. Confirm, accent. Uh, what I can I Libya? What are you doing? 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 Kabude Bakimana. What brought him here is a kidnapping. He kidnapped four times. And he did one in Abaji. One in Abaji. Okay. Out of Abaji, they collected a ransom of uh, two million. Mm -hmm. He spent just two days with them, and uh, the ransom was paid, and the uh, victim was released. Mm -hmm. The other one spent three days with them, and uh, they collected a ransom of 800,000. Mm -hmm. Out of Gadabi, they collected 700,000. That one spent just four days with them. That one baby spent three days with them. And they collected, they paid the ransom of uh, 760,000 euros. And uh, when he came back, he then went to Kaduna. He has also been in and out of prisons. He has been charged to court multiple times, and multiple times he has found his way out, sometimes in very suspicious and uh, very mysterious circumstances. himself with others here will be made to face very diligent persecution in our course of law. What criminals do? Acting on the advice of their legal handlers is to move away disperse, and that's what we call it the dispersal effect. They disperse from those jurisdictions with stricter legislations and simply migrate, cross over to, to jurisdictions with weaker legislations. And because of the federal nature, because of the federated um, character of our country, it becomes important, therefore, that we uniformly pursue a strong and stringent regulation or legislations against heinous crimes such as kidnappings, cattle rustlings, and unlawful possession of weapons.